This is ABC's World News Now. Hello to our fans online. I'm Rena Ninen. And I'm Devin Dwyer with our top stories on this Monday, July 14th. The Middle East is on the brink of an all-out war. Thousands of Palestinians are fleeing their homes in Gaza as Israel and Hamas continue to exchange rocket fire, with both sides now ignoring international calls for a ceasefire. Thousands of Israeli troops massed along the border. A ground offensive may be inevitable. Nearly 200 people have been killed so far in Gaza, mostly civilians. An unmanned commercial cargo ship has lifted off from the coast of Virginia, carrying 3,000 pounds of supplies for the International Space Station. Much of it is food, but it's also carrying science samples and experimental gym clothes. They're odor-resistant outfits designed to keep the astronauts smelling fresh during their two-hour daily workouts. And back here on Earth, the trash boat regatta took place in Kansas City, Kansas. The fifth annual event took place on the Missouri River. Participants could use only materials they found in the trash. They couldn't spend more than $100 on their boats, which are powered by wind. No motors allowed there. There were prizes for everything from best engineering to least money spent. And to a truly unique summertime event down in the Florida Keys, the 30th annual Lower Keys Underwater Music Festival. Some 500 divers plunged into the deep blue sea to play their instruments, some admittedly fake, while listening to their music pumped into the water from underwater speakers. Participants describe the underwater music as sounding clear and ethereal with the fishes enjoying it as well. The event also comes with a serious message about reef preservation. Get more news anytime at abcnews.com. I'm Rena Knighton. And I'm Devin Dwyer. Thanks so much for watching. This is ABC's World News Now, available anytime, anywhere you want it. More Americans choose ABC News to see the whole picture.